there it is in black and white that it should have been stopped in 1967 and that's three years before I had Sarah. In the review's many pages, words that mean so much to a mum. The hormone pregnancy test Primados that Mary was given in 1970 should have been withdrawn from use three years earlier over fears of links to birth defects. Her daughter Sarah was born without a lower left arm. Mary spent decades pushing for answers. It's the what-ifs, and the what-ifs are horrible, because you do think, if I'd have gone another day, if I'd have seen another doctor, the frustration is that the life she may have had and the things she may have been able to do are what I regret, not who she is or what she is. It shouldn't happen that campaigners like me have to basically put their lives on hold, have to knock on doors, travel up to London, lobby MPs, we've done all that, just to get someone to listen. In the same review, another fight to be heard. Janet has amassed thousands of documents in years of research about the drug Valproate, which she was prescribed for her epilepsy while pregnant. Both of her sons were born with learning difficulties, and the review confirms women weren't adequately warned about the dangers. It's been a total roller coaster ride, and the amount of times where we've reached a position where is, you just feel like giving up mm. because you don't feel like you're getting anywhere. Um, but then it's like, well, we're doing this for the kids. We've got to carry on because if we don't do it for the kids, who else will? A woman constantly blames herself because you've given birth. You know, you've carried that child for nine months and you, it's constant in the back of your mind. You're constantly blaming yourself. That guilt trip is enormous. And, and even now, it, it just doesn't... Even though I know better now, it's still, it's still there. It still niggles. Janet met fellow Valpro 8 mum, Emma, and they combined their resources, becoming best friends, power in numbers. No one believed us. We were referred to as bored housewives. I totally dismissed. So to, to be here today with an achievement of what we've achieved, it's so overwhelming. I have been in that position where I didn't want to fight. And these women who don't have the courage to fight, the courage to stand up, and women should have the courage because, as this campaign's proven, you, you can get there with your voice. Voices heard now more clearly than ever. Women determined to make sure today's review is acted on and does make a difference. Peter Lane, Five News. And it's important that we tell you that the manufacturer of that hormone pregnancy test, Primados, has always denied a link between the drug and deformities in babies.